I'm a singer. Right, well, I'm a cum demon. I that want a freedom. I'm filling with all of my semen. My semen. Like <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? By Lil Nas X. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What is that? By Lil Nas X or something. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Twerking on the devil. Lil dude, Nas dude, X. Dude, canceled, bro. Huh? Did you record it? I don't know. <coughs> so. Yeah, bro, I'm being coughing on this thing. Eric got COVID. COVID yesterday. From him. Yo. Yeah. Whoa. Did you actually get it? No. Yeah. He I mean, how would I know? I don't well, know if Everyone know. would have COVID. So. If I had COVID, that means he has COVID. You have COVID. All right. I knocked out motherfucking phones. Yeah, motherfucking phones. Whoa, yeah, motherfucking phones. Motherfucking Motherfucking Elon Musk just tweeted a photo, dude. Did he? Is that what that said? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like how he just has notifications on for everybody. Me? Oh Elon. Yeah. I don't I don't use Imagine so I Imagine when you put out an Instagram post, everyone on Instagram gets your notification. That'd be sick. You'll have like a million views every day. <laughs> views wouldn't matter and neither would likes and they wouldn't even neither equate would to anything. <laughs> what? <laughs> What? 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 How, 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 it like uh, just I did uh, And when uh, you bring uh, that thing on uh, me You don't do it, uh, get me kids uh, Cause I'm gonna uh, all in you And you uh, don't uh, have uh, it and have them bits uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 it is a beautiful day here. We have some beautiful people with us right now. Um, I don't really know what that song is that's playing right now, but it's called uh, How. It's <laughs> oh, called no, How. He can't, hear the, he can't hear the song. There's a song playing right oh, now. There's like yeah. audio in the back. Oh, yeah. is there? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I see how it is. Damn. Damn. Yeah, you don't but have hey, fancy. we're here. We're in the apartment right now, and we're here to talk about some great scootering content, I think. Daniel, you asked me a couple days ago, you're like, yo, I want to talk about scootering right now. Mm. So what in scootering has been making your mind storm? Honestly, when I hit you up, I just wanted to talk about, I honestly can't even remember. <laughs> my memory's so shit. Like <laughs> when I hit you up, there was something on my mind that I wanted <laughs> to talk about. And right now it's not coming to mind. Since then, it has been really um hectic isn't the right word because hectic is used like negatively but it's been um eventful and just like it's been very eventful the, been this a lot past of events. weekend we've had so much shit going on we've had cramps's wedding mm. amazing by let's the just way. pause right yeah, there beautiful. let's hear about cramps's wedding yeah real quick. let's hear about cramps because I, I personally wasn't there unfortunately and i feel just regretful for not being there but Ooh. daniel and all of you guys were there right yeah. yes sir. yeah enlighten me well, we woke up one morning. We did. <laughs> specifically Friday morning. Yeah. Friday morning. And we booked it to Tucson for Cramps, Chris Clark's wedding. So shout out to Cramps and Kelsey for getting wedding for getting wed. Woo! We're very proud of both of you and yes, it was are. an amazing time. Um, we had a lot of fun. It was um <laughs> We were the life of the party. Oh, yeah, honestly. to be honest, oh, Cramps Cramps watching this will know we were the life. Even Kelsey like we were the life of the party. Everyone else was kind of like having their own little vibe, which was old. Yeah, like kind of. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Was there a lot of old people there? Yes, sir. I honestly didn't observe the room like I that. I just the only thing that I picked up was that it was dead when we weren't loud. 
every time we were talking, joking, dancing, mm-hmm. and then stopped, it was just dead all around. You know what I mean? So like you guys we were, were the energy. When we were mm-hmm. yelling and talking, it, it kind of sounded like every, it, like it was just loud all around. You know what I mean? But then as soon as we stopped, it was, it was dead. People felt comfortable when we were making noise. That's what it was. So they yeah. felt comfy enough to join in. And that, that's like <clears throat> on everything that we did that day. Whether it was sitting down to eat and we were conversing or on the dance floor twerking. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like we get busy, you know? Busy. They don't do it like us. Ooh. That's that. Did you premiere that video part at the wedding? No, Cramps wanted it. wasn't part of the plan. I, it was like my little like gift to Cramps to just finish the edit for him. Yeah. And, uh, and get it up on the day. I didn't announce it to him. I didn't tell him. I just wanted him to find out on his own when like Trend Kill posted it. And uh, he called me the first. He called me on our way to Tucson. It's a two-hour drive for those who don't know from Phoenix to Tucson. And uh, he called me the first time screaming. He was just like, "What, dude? Oh my god, I can't believe it!" <laughs> and I'm like, "Did you like it?" And he goes, he "I don't know. I haven't it. watched it yet." <laughs> <laughs> he's like, "I can't. I just can't believe I'm on Trend Kill. This is so sick." What? And he's like, "All right, dude. I'm gonna call you when I'm done." And then uh, he called me when he was done. And uh, he was he, he was crying. <laughs> it was, he was crying. It was, was a very emotional video he was, part. He was saying thank you and he loved it. And that's all I could ever ask for was that he loved it. So shout out to Cramps. Because that, yeah. that video part was a long time in the making. That was like you can tell, five you can, years of footage. You can tell by his hair. Yeah. And his scooter. But more so the hair and like the facial hair, you know. <laughs> so, the evolution of his of his. <laughs> Head hair. <laughs> that boy's hey. looking like Stevie Wonder. <laughs> well, yeah. w- was that intermission piece? Uh, was that his mom or who? Yeah, that was his mom. Okay. So I had his mom call me because I had that footage. I had that B roll of his mom and Jack's um, from just one of the nights that I slept over at his crib years ago. And um, I didn't want to just throw it in there and just like mix it with the rest of the B-roll and make it. Like, you have to have the right mood like, for something like meaning. that. <laughs> to me, if I just threw it in there, it would have it would have been meaningless in my perspective. Like I wanted to add like a pedestal to that specific B-roll. You know what I mean? So I um I messaged his mom, had her call me, and I explained to her what I was doing, and she was about it. And so I just um on my little broadcaster setup, I just plugged her in through my phone and recorded it. And um, yeah, she, it was just over the phone and recorded that phone call, uh, threw it into the video and it worked very well. It flowed very well into the Earl Sweatshirt song. I think it went like crazy. Like the, the whole, pe- like the three section video format where it's like you had like the first song and then you had like that. It was like a very intimate like part where it was like, dang, this is like a look into his, his life, his personal life in a it sense. Like a, like a, like a epically later type beat. Bro, the sick, the sickest part is seeing how young Jackson was in that B-roll and just knowing how old he is now. When At the wedding, we were dancing with Jackson. He was going crazy. <laughs> he was going crazy. He was doing cartwheels and he was cursing at women and sh- stuff. <laughs> 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 I'm, just, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But like, he, he's, he's talking and he's moving. And in that B-roll that I had, he could barely talk. He was learning how to talk. Yeah. He could barely like... He was just jumping off the couch and stuff. Like, that's all he was doing then. He grew up so fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good AC. Yeah, but, right. uh, yeah, his video. I'm proud. I'm, I'm proud on that video. Are we, I'm really proud on the do video. Do we have more cramps footage in the barrel? <laughs> we for, have so much. There for was, like a later date. There was a lot that I didn't use. A lot of it's going to be just used on like a team, like a Northern team video or like another little like cramps throwaway video. Like, you name it. We Cramps has a lot of footage and we had a lot of footage to sort through. Yeah. I remember you showed me one of the drafts of his, it was like all of his footage. It was like its own video part. In it was itself. his own full length. Yeah. yeah it was like, his own full length. The cramps, cramps, cramps the movie. <laughs> <laughs> it was cramps the movie. It's funny. But okay, so we had the wedding, we had the video part. What Wait, else did, I still want to talk about the wedding. That yeah, was so tell me more fun. about it. So me I want and other Jay, people to talk. Yeah, yeah, me and Jay hadn't even ever met Cramps. Oh, really? We just yeah, pulled up to the wedding. Man, <laughs> first yeah. time Damn. he's like about to dress in his fucking groom suit, and he's he is a quality guy. Yeah, I he's a know. sick cunt. He's fucking funny. <laughs> he's a sick cunt. Yeah. <laughs> 
But that was so weird, just like turning up to this, like <clears throat> me and Jed had no idea whose wedding it was, but Brito was just we like, yeah, go on. Yeah. And by the end of the ran. night, and by the end of the night, and we were- Yeah, I, mean, I, t- I told the Daniel boys said, and we went to a Marshalls and we just all got the same white button up. <laughs> <laughs> and like, that was the uniform for yeah. that night. Yeah, no tie. Yeah, no tie needed. Just all white buttons. It would have came off anyways. Yeah, exactly. We were getting sick. Oh, we were getting silly. <laughs> Absolutely silly. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it was dope. Yes. Indy, was... Indy was rocking the dance floor with me all night. Yeah, he was in there. All night. We didn't leave? Jay was in and out. Eric was in and out. Eric <laughs> Eric was Eric, a little distracted. He but folded. He was distracted. <laughs> what was your distraction? Just he had a sweet tooth that night. Uh, uh, sweet tooth with some sugar. Uh, uh, <laughs> shout out sugar. Shout out sugar. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, that's funny. <laughs> Man, listen. Man, listen. Man, listen. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, tell him, Eric. Tell him what? Yeah, tell us about it. What y'all want he me was, to say? He was what? a bubble blowing baby that Whoa. night. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's telling me right now. You got I bubbles? Don't, I don't. I don't. I think uh, I they, the, the, the tables at the wedding had bubbles. Like for for after, no, like, was that the, the chairs thing. for oh, okay, the ceremony? Yeah, during the yeah. ceremony. Oh, while we're on the ceremony, shout out to Cramps and Kelsey for having a sick playlist. Oh, oh my yeah. God. Yeah, yeah. They it's walked like, out to Players Club Anthem. Yeah. Well, Cramps did. Yo, what? <laughs> and the so beat fun. dropped when Daniel walked out. With a white amazing. woman. <laughs> With a white woman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm expecting like some, some <laughs> organs or something like that. No, like, no. dun, 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 dun. No, dude, nah. it, was, it was better than that. Like, yeah. honestly. And then better than after that. the ceremony, they walked out to Bound 2 by Kanye. Bound. To fall in in love. That's sick. Bound. It was so dope. Oh, yeah. It was so dope. So shout out to them for uh, orchestrating that very well and beautifully. That's and the where, bubbles. Where was it? Like, where, what kind of venue was it? It's funny because the venue was across the street from a spot that Cramps built. That rail. Yeah, Tucson, yeah, 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 yeah. That little building across the street is where it is. And then where after the ceremony, they all went to the spot In to session. the rail check, check. and had a session. Like the miss, uh, Kelsey. Well, I seen all yeah, those pictures. You know, yeah. you know the rail that Cramp built. So it's like on the other side of like where the freeway or that road mm-hmm. dips not down. Even, no, no, not even there. Literally it's, it's across like on the, the street. Like to turn into the dip, it's right there on the like that road. Wow. Like going, going. Uh, that next, had or, that had to be like intentional. East, like the east west road. It had to be intentional. I hope yeah, it was. Surely. Yeah, I hope it was. They did a full on wedding photo shoot at the rail. At the rail, yeah. <laughs> Everyone's on scooters, roller skates, skateboards. Yeah, so a lot of Kelsey's homegirls, they they roller skate and um and skate like skateboard. Shout out Skatey. <laughs> <laughs> I only know one I only well, I know her name and Sugar's name only because they sat at our table. Okay, Sugar. Sugar and Skatey. Mm-hmm. Skatey. Shout out Sugar. <laughs> That's, he's not too fond of skating <laughs> shut up so we're at the tables like eating after the after the uh the ceremony and stuff and the for, eric kept his bubbles from the ceremony like on the chairs because you're supposed to blow the bubbles i mm-hmm. thought everyone did I didn't even blow them. eric had his and so we're sitting at the table have been strapped and you know eric bro i mean look at him he's smooth my boy's fly. He's, he's smooth. He's yeah. got game. Yeah, smooth. Man. He's smooth. He's a smooth criminal. So he uses the bubbles <laughs> to tell, I'm not going to say which one. One of the girls. One, they- <laughs> one of the girls, not skating. <laughs> <laughs> if, if they wanted to see a trick. And so he had her blow bubbles at his face. <laughs> So he could eat them. <laughs> so he could catch the bubbles. <laughs> like, just eat them. Damn. But it was honestly so... I'm not going to lie. It sounded, it sounds stupid because it kind of is. It was smooth. <laughs> but he, it was smooth. Like, he caught it, like, with a little sensual tug mo- motion. He was like... And wow. It, it, like, landed hey, on bro. his bro, tongue. Bro, that's low, that's low key clean. You the know, with the soap though, taste. There was uh. a chair in between the two of them at first. But yeah. when, when the bubbles was going on, they had to move closer. Oh. So the bubbles would reach. Okay, I don't know. Okay, he's smooth with it. Bam. He's smooth, you know. I was about to make a like a bubble joke, like we about he's to weed a him double out. bubble blowing baby. Yeah, double bubble blowing <laughs> baby, <laughs> and we know how to weed him out. <laughs> We're looking for a bubble. Blow. We know how to weed him out. 
Yeah, it was it was dope. It was so dope. Shout out Chase for the terrible best man speech. Ooh. Oh, what was that like? <laughs> Man, bro. Right, he's, he's definitely heard that. He's going to hear this. <laughs> One, we could have went to Cheesecake Factory at the fucking bachelor <laughs> party. Two, he wrote his, his speech like, I don't know, like on the way to Tucson or something. <laughs> Two hours. Hey, Cramps, you know, I've known you for a while and... Best one to you after. Like, what, what did he say? It was, was kind of like that. He, he had like a he had like a like a checklist oh. of like you know bullet points. So when he finished one point, he'd go, "Yeah, um, and uh, so yeah, you're a scooter rider, and that's and you're one of the best ones, and you're you've gone through some crazy battles and Jeez. tough times." He pulled a, a wheel at outlet, you know, when you do bro, an outlet. Uh, the you PowerPoint the, presentation. the presentations. The best one was that's when he was he like. And we love Cramps because he's so... Um, hey, my speech was dope. Kind. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> this is bullet point. I'm saying like he did, he did it like it was a presentation. Like and I, not like school. it was a, yeah. a oh, best man Mine speech. was a presentation. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. I was, giving, I was giving him tips. Like after the ceremony, I was giving Chase tips of like what I would have said if I was like in his position. And honestly, it was some pretty fire tips. <laughs> I gave him one really good tip. Like just and he ate he ate it up. Did you touch tips? <laughs> Did you touch tips? Nah, no. his tip no. was nothing I wanted to be a part of. Nah, was I didn't, what, was I didn't want his tip anywhere near me. Did bro. you just have bigger tip than him? Yeah, it was yeah. it's just like it was it was like smoother. Uh, <laughs> and it was and it was more appropriate for the yeah. time. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? His was just kind of like rough. Rough. Yeah. Did you, you have a better sticky. speech? It, it wasn't it wasn't presentable. No. You know? Ooh, Give you us the speech about. right now. What would you say right now? I'm I'm crazy. Y'all wanna hear it? And I'm here. Yeah. Yeah. What is your All best right. man? Well, speech? I didn't write anything down. Okay, I was just kind of dribbling. Yeah, yeah, I was kind of waffling in my head. Just freestyle it? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. So I would have been there. I would have been like I would have been like, hey, what's up, everybody? intros because you know intros are always so awkward to break the ice you is know this I mean? part of it or no no no, no, no. Okay. i'm telling you guys like, i'm just gonna tell, like it would have been some shit like this it's like you know me and cramps we've we met a long time ago through scootering and since then we've been on a ton of scooter trips and we've gotten to know each other pretty close and on trips we just you know not everything is sweet not everything is nice Hmm. We would bump heads. We would argue. We'd get under each other's skin. And I'm going to be honest, at times I would literally say like, oh my God, like how is Cramps ever going to find someone who, can, <laughs> who is patient enough to deal with him? And long <laughs> behold, God blessed him with a beautiful woman who could. That was one tip I gave Chase. He, wow. didn't, he didn't even use it. Wow. He didn't he didn't that's a good it. one. He didn't that's use a it. good one because it's, it's so true. It is true. It, it really is true. <laughs> it's true. Crumps is a dick. <laughs> <laughs> pumping. God, Bro, pumping. That was one of the things I thought of. I didn't think of a whole speech because I wasn't in a position to. Yeah. But that was just like one of the things I would have included. If I had to do a whole speech, it would have been straight fire, bro. It would have been so gas. I think I, I would have made at least one person cry. You already you already made cramps cry with the video. Yeah, true. Mm. Mm. Pumping. Hey, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't know cramps and Chris were that close. I mean, the cramps. <laughs> I didn't know cramps and Chase were that close of friends. I, I don't think anyone did. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess they are, you know. So. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah! No, hey, they're Chase, all the boys. Shit. I, I teased Chase knows. Chase knows I love the fool, but like. I teased him so much the day of the bachelor party because we went to Castles and Coasters, Olive Garden, and then Boondocks. <laughs> like, that was the bachelor party. Who planned it? Chase. Chase. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it was his job. No, oh, no, dude, no, no, was, no. Me no, and no, Brandon no. were there. And Here's I was, what's happening. We're hitting up Top Golf for a spot, all right? This is you? This is your we were, party? Strip club. Okay. If any one of my boys are getting married, we're going strip club. And that's Classic. Classic. And then we're going to either casino or nightclub. Okay, turn up. Wait, what we Two eat? of those wait, things wait, wait, almost we happened. We didn't eat. We were supposed to go Top to Top Golf. Golf. We were supposed we're to go to Top Golf. Top Golf. I don't want to eat. It's a restaurant. Uh, we were supposed to go to Top solid. Golf after Olive Garden, but we didn't like the whole group didn't have enough peas like collectively. <laughs> That's and, um, money for you guys. Don't know. <laughs> <laughs> peas pounds, and so um, and it was so funny because the entire time I was like. I was teasing Chase. I was like, bro, really? Like Olive Garden? We couldn't go to Cheesecake? <laughs> like, you couldn't, like, come on, bro. Cheesecake. Like the entire night. Anytime, anytime there was a pocket for me to slip that in, 
I slipped that or shit. BJ's. In. BJ's? Yeah. Nah, bro. We're in America. Cold beers and cheeseburgers. Uh, hey, <laughs> keep AZ keep red. Keep AZ red. Uh, yeah. bro, I was telling Brandon. I was telling Brandon. I told him two things. One was, bro, I looked over to him when we were at Castles and Coasters. I'm like, bro, imagine if we were rich right now. Like, imagine the shit we could be doing if we were rich. For real. Like, if we could have just gotten married w- when we were rich. Like, cramps, you know? Like, that was one thing. Two was I said, bro, if I was in charge, we would have been in Vegas right now. I know it's cliche. Hell yeah, we would have been in Vegas. But it's four hours away. It's just four hours. Yeah. Like, hop in the forerunner, bro. We're out. You know what I mean? And I would have gotten us tickets to, like, a show, one six show. I would have gotten us a suite at fucking, uh, what's it, the Venetian. Because every room there's a fucking suite. Is and it? I would have done, yeah, and I would have done the homework of finding out which fucking, like, uh, escort was, like, <laughs> the best ones in town. Boop, 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 boop. Hi, yeah, what are, your, like, your A-list escorts? Oh, for that much? Okay. Well, send us five, please. Like, at least five <laughs> <laughs> to room blah, blah, blah this time. You know what I mean? Like, cramps. It would have been, been dope. You, I told him, just, just do it now. Like just like that would have been a rush. Plan. That would have been a rush. Do that party. now. Book it for fifteen years in advance. Yeah, like book all of that fifteen and years in advance. If and if one of us is getting married that getting married, year, it's his bachelor party. And if not, say the line. Bro. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and if not, we're making a recap video and just captioning it. Throw, uh, gotta throw a party for oh. my day ones. Okay. Shout out Drake. Shout out Drake. <laughs> Damn, Shout out Toronto. But rapping, me. Let's bring it back to what did happen instead of what could have happened, yeah, right? Because yeah. it was still could've, fun overall, but and I do appreciate didn't. what did happen because it ended up being such an amazing night. So we're back at the table. Eric's blowing bubbles into some girl's face. <laughs> <laughs> She's eating them, right? Because he because <laughs> he caught the bubble. And now he's like, ah, no, your turn, your turn, your turn. <laughs> like you got to catch it, you got to catch it. <laughs> he's guy. blowing bubbles in her face. Not one was executed properly. Yeah, yeah. But then that it was time. Then went. it was time to dance. Mm. It was like, all right, all the couples come to the dance floor. <sighs> My boy. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> My boy. He just went. Hey, you want to dance? <laughs> 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 he went like this. Want to dance? <laughs> 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 Yeah, and that of course lying. she said yes. Why? Because this boy was shooting layups uh, all night. Uh, Couldn't make a three though. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> On the dance floor, right? He's he's doing so well, so was good. It, he know. was killing it. We're on the fucking dance floor. I get close because I from a distance I filmed a clip. I have a clip of Eric dancing. Right? It's so good. Put the phone down. I'm like getting closer. <laughs> And there it goes. Hey, <laughs> they were they were all dancing. They were we, we, we were we, all dancing. So now. everybody came to the little circle. You know, is you know you get in the little circle. You uh uh do your little two step. Whatever you are gonna do. And I told her. I was like, hey, I was, it was hurts. I was telling her to get in there. You know, I say get in there, skatey. <laughs> oh, and I'm like, no, you didn't. Oh. <laughs> Because <laughs> you were you were messing with bubbles, not skating. No. Yeah, with we'll, bubbles, bubbles, we'll yeah. bubbles. Yeah, we'll, <laughs> he was messing with bubbles. <laughs> What's your name? Oh yeah, sugar, 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 <laughs> sugar, sweet. Damn. Yeah, After skating. that, she went and sat down. Oh, <laughs> but she let, They went somewhere. I don't she even was know crying. Just dipped. Yeah. Damn. God, I'm yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> That's what they called the dirty tea. <laughs> yeah, we, yeah. That fumbled the bag. It Spoiled is what it is. Hey, but who picked it up? Ah, <laughs> yeah. Wait, you picked it up? He picked it up. Someone had to make a play. Someone had to. Make a play. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was very fumbled in a horrible way. So it was cool. All right. Honestly, what did it was me and Indy were killing it. We didn't leave the dance floor once. We honestly had everyone staring at us we the did. whole night. Whether they were looking at us for good reasons or bad reasons, they were looking. And they had all both reasons. All publicity is good publicity. They had exactly. all the reasons. They had all the reasons. We were popping, we gave it locking, to them. bobbing, dipping, all sorts. Trumping, tripping, crip, crumping, 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 
<laughs> we were proud munches that night. We were, I was oh. <laughs> <laughs> munching. Bro, even Cramps was getting lit on the dance floor. Cramps was going crazy. Well, he was always his, does. Cramps was in his element. Bro, I swear if we weren't there, I don't think he would have gotten like I don't he think wouldn't he wouldn't have gotten jiggy like that. Because the rest of the dance floor were just like two stepping, shoulder bopping. Not like, even no, two stepping, no, no rhythm faces, either. no, no, no energy. You no know what I mean? Sweat pouring off the no face. No sweat. <laughs> we were there, like, I kid you not, we were throwing elbows. We were <laughs> we were <laughs> three pointers. We were pissing everyone off. <laughs> yeah. Especially when the request came in, when it was no longer whatever the DJ had playing, and we were going up to the thing and telling them, play this, play that, play this. <laughs> yeah, like that. Bro, bro, bro. At one point, this one lady, I don't know who she was, I don't know who she was associated with. That's not my problem. All right. <laughs> <laughs> but she, <laughs> what is my problem though? Is she came up to Cramps while we were in our circle and she was like, grabbed him by the shoulder and she was like, can you tell your friends to calm down, please? <laughs> Did she? Yes. No, not at your own wedding. Yes. Yeah, it's crazy, huh? You yes. can't do that at your own wedding. Well, I saying? promise I you. didn't know that. And all I'll say is Cramps did That's not weak. tell one of us to calm no, down. No, he didn't tell us to calm down. He, <laughs> he just went. <laughs> 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 uh, and we kept it. We kept it jumping. Kept it moving. Yeah, it was such oh, a good time, bro. Imagine going oh. to a wedding and telling people to like, yo, you need to calm down. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that's some weak shit right there. Right? Yeah, my boy's getting married. It's his last day as a free man, a free agent. Free agent? <laughs> <laughs> it was cool. It was fun. And Jackson was there, was too. Like, Jackson was there. He was Killing doing cartwheels. It. He was... Uh, Balling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were, we were, we were uh, singing... Uh, A$AP Ferg. We fly. We fly. No, no lie. lie. You know it. And he would yell. It to Jackson, he'd go, Ballin! <laughs> that was fire. Kelsey and Cramps clarified later that that's his favorite song. <laughs> it was so dope. That's hella funny. Yeah, that yeah, was good. That was my first, like, homie wedding. Yeah, you I can was... watch a small recap of that on my vlog. Yes. You go can on go on YouTube, Eric Too Real. You know, check that out. Shameless and, plug, shameless yeah, plug. Yeah, you know, you, you know another homie got married this weekend. Who was that? Yeah. Oh my dude, who got married? Hey, he ain't no homie to you. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Is that good or bad? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> that was messed up, bro. <laughs> that was messed Ooh, up. Was I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I know. Will, who, who, who was it? I forgot. Honestly, <laughs> Andrew Roussard. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's why. Well, that's my yeah. homie. That's, that's the homie. Yeah, <laughs> the mustache what you talking about? Yeah, what? the owner of Proto what got you, married. What you talking about? Oh, I don't know, bro. Oh, yeah, your life don't matter. Yeah, yeah. Ha ha ha. But ha ha. <laughs> hey, all of them do. So, you so. know it's bowling. <laughs> <laughs> no, I saw that, though. I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew, the mustache man, Broussard. <laughs> Godfather. Yeah. yeah, speaking of mustaches, let's talk about Indies. Ooh. Indy's, whole cut. What, do you, what do you think, Will? Because Indy's at a point where he like, I don't want to look racist. Yeah, let him, let him, <laughs> let him. Go ahead. So what happened? Because he's not talking no, about no, it. No, no, no. Oh, wait, are you asking me? Sorry. I, yeah. Because you got the glasses on. I can't. Since, since can you last... just pull your glasses up a sec so I can see where your eyes are looking? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> since the last time you had them here, <clears throat> Indy's become a changed man. Yeah, hey. I'm American now. <laughs> He's has give you a best That's American accent right now. That was right a, now, right now, right now. You want an American accent? Yeah. <laughs> give your best New York accent. New York, New <laughs> York. I put them on. I put them on. Club pump and cock jump. You just sound, <laughs> <laughs> you sound <Enough>. British. <laughs> Do I? Hey, give us your best Liverpool accent. Oh, just like a heavy Scouse accents and that, yeah? Yeah. Well, what do you want, thank kid? <laughs> what do you want, thank you? What do you want, thank you? Do you want me to give you a little sentence and then see yeah, if you can translate yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, But, um, yeah, I'll whip your brow out and battle as a job, there, lads. <laughs> <laughs> no, if that ain't, if that ain't no the fucking truth. <laughs> what, we've, we've said what have you? It? Have you? Are we getting a little scrambling or what then, the boys? <laughs> yeah, but you knew, I don't think you ever elaborated on it, man. Yeah, for real. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm with you on that one, bro. Yeah, sweet. Go ahead, Danny's having it or what? Duh. He's not on it. <laughs> I'm not. You need to be on it like a car bonnet or you're off it, kid. In there like swimwear. You need to be on it like a saying? car bonnet. That yeah. one I know. That one in there. You gotta be in there like swimwear, yeah. 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 Y'all yeah. stole that. Main vein like on. a... Main vein with the Main vein with the Dada stain. Oh, that's MC ah. Magic. <laughs> Fucking I'm Hank Marvin, me. Hey, yeah. I feel like... I feel like you don't look... You say you're chilling with who? This. I said I'm Hank Marvin. The Migos. I'm starving. I'm hungry. I need some food. 
Some grub. Some you definitely grub. don't look racist. You just look like you're from a different era in America. Oh, okay. That's dude, what I told him. Okay. He, he suited the, uh, the Freddie Mercury. He did. He did yeah. suit the Freddie Mercury. Well, that's why the mustache came out, really. It was for Purely Freddie. Purely for Freddie. And then we got the mole. I feel like you need some chops. Some chops. What are chops? Oh, now it's that like would heavy, make them heavy look sideburns. like sideburns. No, nah, oh. that's a whole different. That's a whole different vibe. Yeah, you don't want that. No. So look, Indy got Indy got his mustache and his mullet all in the same day. Right? He had like a it little scruffy intense. beard. And hey, he's what? wasn't scruffy. I don't know. No, no. Who said that? You had a great natural. beard. Who's yeah. that? Who's that? Was scruffy? I don't know. I had someone I say, say it. Was, you said was, that, was that Clayton? Had to be. All right, look, we're past that. Anyways, right. yeah. you're lucky you're behind that computer screen. <laughs> <laughs> so he 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 changed his look, his entire look in one day. Yeah, and it was a it's a drastic change and a big difference. Mm -hmm. And um, he's been having some like identity <laughs> issues. <since then. laughs> well, it's also the rest of the outfit. At too. first, at first, he was feeling his mullet. We I we still feel oh, his mullet. Yeah. I love his mullet. It's like the real mullet. Yeah, it's a great mullet. And then uh, after the whole Freddie. Facade. Halloween the facade. Freddy facade. Yeah. He was like, I want to get rid of the mustache. And I was saying, like, I don't know, the mustache kind of keeps your look kind of on like the rocker fool side, like the indie guy, the yeah, yeah. The, like the cool. And I am an indie guy. Like he you looks are indie guy. Like he looks guy. the indie yeah, but guy. But you need the he, mustache. He looks, you can't take the mustache. He looks, he looks like he has a mullet because he's with the shits, right? But if he were to shave the mustache, he'd look like he was in the sticks. You know what I mean? Ooh. Hey, that was hard. That was hard. Thank you. Hey, so pal, so brother. Pal, yeah. bro. So no, pal. You need to keep the mustache. All right. You don't I mean, need, You can it. do whatever you want. I know I can. But like, right, I'm not going to take it. But that's just orders from you. Yeah, yeah, no. Cut off half. Don't ever. Cut off half. Keep the eyebrows. Cut off half. Keep the eyebrows. I'm not going to take the eyebrows off. A slit in the eyebrow will get your ass eaten like that. My ass eaten? By who? Eaten. By you. Eden. Eden. I'll get my ass eaten. Eden. Eden. <laughs> Eden will be neck deep in I'll that asshole. I'll be eating that shit. <laughs> 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 neck deep in that asshole. Nice. Uh, has anyone got a razor? Should we Shave just do it half. Right now? Yeah. Should we just do it right now? Yo. Nah. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Clayton's on the way. So, what's your opinion on the stash? I our friend, should, our friend Maddie, it. our friend Maddie said he should keep it. She, oh. she, she likes oh, his mustache. The is man's this the, the lawnmower yeah. three point oh? <laughs> Yo, y'all really doing right, it? Is he actually doing it? <laughs> wait, wait, are we doing it? Yeah, I think wait, wait, we are. I kind of want to get it real quick. <laughs> I mean, I was joking, but <laughs> well, <laughs> the race is wait, on. It's, it's on camera. You. Yes, no, yes, no. Wait for the eyebrow slit. Yeah, cut the eyebrow yeah. slit. Give him a slit. Send it. Damn, I hate to reminisce. That's that's another drastic change to your life. Oh, it died. Oh, oh, I wanted it so much. Uh, <laughs> I got another one. Oh, he's got another one. Oh, oh, I mean, wait, wait, that's, that's just like whatever. That I mean, like odds on. That one's for the bush. That was for the bush. That was for the bush. That was for the bush. Yeah, our friend Maddie said she she digs his, his look. She digs him. And she's fit. I think that was a sign. That was a sign not to cut it. Yeah. Because yeah. you probably would have cut God's it very playing, badly. Playing. And then. Yeah, yeah, Will was shaking. Bush. Shaky with the toaster. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my stomach dropped a little bit then when the razor came out. <laughs> she looked at me like, oh. <laughs> I mean, I was ready, but obviously yeah, God didn't intend it. Yeah, no. facts. So. All right, yeah, so, so. Let's bring it back. So, Cramps' mm. wedding, that happened. We had his video part come out. That's yes. kind of a package deal right there. Yeah. yeah. And Big then package. the next day. Outlet, we had outlet. Outlet, yeah. outlet four, baby. Outlet was spectacular. Got was home late, woke up late, <laughs> got there late. Yeah, <laughs> bro, that you was such it. an overtake or such an overtaking working on that skate park. Literally for the two months leading up. Yeah, but well, Tristan and told me he was welding the coping and all the metal and shit like the night before. Yeah, no, it was literally the night before. That's really? hectic. Yeah, no, we finished the park literally at like 10 p.m. the night before. No. And then it was like this comp the very next morning. Oh my god! Yeah, like it was really dusty in there, yo. We had okay. We had like mopped and sweeped the whole thing prior as yeah, well, dude. but it's just there was so much damn sawdust in there. Every day you would work there, you'd go home and blow your nose, and you'd it'd just uh, be full of like black bogey, black, black yeah. shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I do have a complaint. I don't know what it was. I I I I put more thought into it afterwards, and I feel like the blue. In there, mm, mm, mm -hmm. kind of gave it a like a dark down vibe. Yeah, 
No, so I was so I have this color theory idea about about just colors inside of skate parks and also just open places. I think there's like a a certain mark that you get to where you cross into like is this color influenced by white or is it influenced by black? And I feel like that that color in there was could have been the same tone of blue, but it was just like too dark of a blue. Like if it was lighter blue, it would like be the, more like upbeat. One hundred. If but, it was but, the if it was the color of the undialed urethane. Or what about this? Yeah, but but it's like <laughs> yeah. Huh? I, I feel like you need to have like, like a baby crazy blue. lighting in there, but it still just creates like this weird like almost shadow to it. Ooh, the light was, was very sporadic though. It was very. It was like there was little bulbs. Yeah. Was when we dark. walked, when we walked in, it was very dim. The camera yeah. settings that I had were like capped. Like wow. I, I had to turn the gain all the way up. Shutter speed was at its lowest. No ND filters. I personally uh, like, like the orange at the other park, yeah, especially for like well, the like Halloween hot, jam. Like a like yeah, High energy, and bro. it was uh, yeah, it was so it was weird. Like the the whole the vibe was very like, uh, like bl blue. <laughs> hey, <laughs> but it was like kind of cold in a way. Uh, like I know what you're trying to say. Park, our northern park next year when we up, it's gonna be purple. We all. Yeah, it's gonna be a, a hey, nice, better be a, a nice light lavender. purple. It's gonna be lavender. light purple. Lavender. Yeah, lavender. nice and beautiful. Not dark purple. No, no, we don't do dark. I remember when I was a kid, I really wanted to paint my room black. And my dad was, and, and my dad was like, "No, you're not doing that." And I was like, "Why?" And he's like, Why "Do you hate me, Dad?" It's. <laughs> I was like, "He's like, because it'll just look bad." <laughs> and now I kind of get it. Like I don't know, it's just like dark colored paint. I if you're gonna fill it the whole way, it doesn't. Tommy Cush, when we were in high school, he painted one wall in his room black but it was the chalk paint yeah 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 and he bitches, still has bitches that. went crazy over that shit like really? bitches loved coming over smoking his weed and then drawing on the chalk uh, <laughs> on the chalk wall on the chalk wall yeah yeah yeah, yeah. 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 Hey, we, one time for an undialed video we painted a scooter deck chalkboard how'd nice. that go uh it was just where we is it repainted it oh <laughs> And it was, then we, it was not lit. We it repainted was a, it whiteboard. It wasn't the lituation you were looking for. <laughs> yeah. Lituation. So then you could use giant and race it, markers. And that, and that is, that's right there. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> that's wicked. Yeah. Ah. But, but yeah, you, how did, our turn, how did Outlook go for you? How, like, you know, as the people putting it on, Clayton, you're allowed to chime in. You're welcome. As the people, <laughs> I'm just kidding. As the people putting on the event, you guys put in a lot of work towards outlet for every and each stop. And um, in my opinion, the first three were very alive compared to this last one. Be I feel like it was the blue. Like, I feel like it was the blue. And I, I, I mean, that's that's what it came down to. But how did it go for you guys? So I think that outlet, like... I, I continuously say this whenever I speak about outlets, but it's like, I don't think there was one best outlet. I think all of them had points that were really high and points that were potentially kind of low. And I think that depending on the outlet, they've all changed a little bit. And I think a big reason why there's been certain high moments at certain outlets is because of the venue, the crowd that was specifically there that day maybe just the energy of that time of the year and just everything that's involved. Um, but I definitely feel like this outlet had characteristics about it that were really awesome and, and big growth for outlet. Like I think the whole outside portion with all of the, the booths and the food truck and the people selling stuff, like that was really awesome to actually get that going. Cause that was, this is the first outlet where that has really been at play at that level. The ESCO one had a few booths and that was really yeah. cool, but I feel like the booths that were at this one weren't necessarily just scooter parts, scooter parts. It was like shout out Heartbreak Harbor. It was yeah, shout out Heartbreak Harbor. Shout out, yes, shout out Heartbreak. Shout, shout out, out Devil's Liquor. Devil's Liquor. Tempe Throwback. Shout out Blackwater. Shout out yeah, Blackwater. BLK. BLK. I talk to them. It's not black. It just happens to be the acronym for it. And I'm like, oh, okay, sick. I don't. Know. It's that. Shout out Kendamas. Shout out uh, Affinity. Shout, shout out, out Pogo Stick guys. Shout out Pogo Stick like. <laughs> All of those extracurricular things I think were really cool at this one. You know the first three outlets, were they all outdoor? No. no. So no. The, the first, first one was, was indoor. indoor. Oh, the first one was indoor. Oh, okay. Yeah. And I think that the indoor is definitely the way to go with outlet in the future. I think the music just radiates better and it's just like a more like it, it's a more inside vibe and and it's easier to police people coming in. I think Esco worked all right because it was a big fence and there was only one entrance. 
Um, but I think, yeah, the paint color was kind of weird now that you bring that up. But there was definitely something kind of dim about this last outlet that yeah. that I feel like was just, and maybe it really was just the lighting. Maybe, maybe it, really, it was Halloween. Ooh. Yeah. Well, yeah, because I put more thought into that as well. It was Halloween, right? Like it was the Halloween themed one. And I feel like because it's Halloween, it should have been at night because Halloween is such a night dark like thing mm -hmm. and having it during the day it just didn't feel halloween ish you know what i mean that's why people took their outfits off Not yeah naked but just. <laughs> no i i i because I, I feel like boo jam last year was a night event you know it was. and yeah. i don't know i feel like if for the next one i feel like that would make sense to have the halloween one be more at night i wish an ideal world it would be halloween on a saturday and not like the 29th because i feel like this whole weekend was kind of funny like i don't think there was an exact halloween this year yeah. it's kind of like the saturday before yeah. halloween was like the night that everyone went out and did halloween style stuff then the sunday was like the weird bridge day where it's like it's still the weekend but it's not yet halloween and then monday rolls around and it's like it's a monday that's kind of weird but it's also like actually halloween i think it was kind of a funny layout of all that happened it was like a dragged out Halloween. <laughs> yeah. We did nothing yesterday for Halloween. Who? Us. Us. It's my fault. Y'all did nothing. I'll take. It's on me. Mm -hmm. I feel like this outlet. Um, one thing that I've really learned through the course of outlet is just what type of venues and skate parks and obstacles would be the best for having that format of competition. And I don't know if the, the way that that skate park is laid out the new az grind i don't know if that is the best for what is trying to happen in the volume of people that are trying to like session it in that format i think that it's a little bit con like tight i don't think you can even there's no flow to that park there is when it's empty it's fun <laughs> i feel like every park has a flow when it's empty yeah not you, everyone you can go everywhere you want but like yeah there's no immediate way like when you walk in you don't say okay i know exactly how i'm gonna ride this park like you, you can't even figure out. You like, kind of like interrupt everyone's flow yeah. when you enter because everything is it's horizontal. Just a box. Yeah, it's, just, it's, it's not that much square footage. That's another thing about it too. Like it's yeah, not because the, biggest the other half is uh, pool, hot tubs. Hot tubs, yeah. But <clears throat> how did you guys like Outlet? It was cool. Like, but like you said, like you know, it was a little more dead than the other, the the previous three. I feel like the, like, you know, the energy was just lower than the other lower, ones. Lower vibration. I also feel like the other ones we've had, like the next gen guys there. Uh, like we've had hunter we've had like a lot for, more for the first one okay from my experience i feel like hunter lit the first one the fuck up yeah like hunter really made that shit pop i know richard won and he deserved to win mm -hmm. but when hunter did like the double flare whip and when hunter did all his crazy shit that he always does um his shit really stood out and Grant, too. Grant Lewis has been killing it throughout all of them. Wasn't Jared at the first one as well? Yeah. yeah. Jared Donaldson was Jared that energy. everything up wherever yeah. he goes. Yes, sir. He's just got that energy. Yeah, the, the next gen kids really light it up. Mm -hmm. um, it's a bummer that the World Roller Games had to happen the same weekend as Outlet. Because yeah. otherwise, all of those people would have been there yeah. this weekend. But also, congratulations to yeah, them. Yeah, no, no, for real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, the third but one that we had I want to see all my well. family eat. Yes, sir. The third one, obviously, me and Jay, that was our first one. And that was that was a good one. It was crazy. It was a good vibe. The Esco Some one was, was good. Yeah. The Esco one was yeah. really good. And we were just I feel like everyone was crazy. at that one. Yeah. 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 Like, and we were just forcing Juzzy to jump the, jump the box and do <laughs> stupid shit. That was the best bit. Where was Juzzy for this good. one? Uh, Juzzy was in LA. Because he's been in LA. He couldn't make it to this one, unfortunately. That boy signed to him. IMG Models now. Mm -hmm. Hey, Sheesh. shout out Jazzy. Yeah. Um, okay. Hey, looking sexy. Don't call me. Don't call yourself a model unless you've been in Vogue. Uh, <laughs> shout out Drake. Again. <laughs> Hasn't he been in Vogue? Yeah. Jazzy. Probably. I don't know. Yeah, I bet he has. Has he really? I think he has. Yeah. I'm pretty sure he has. Has he? I know Beck has. Shout out Beck. Bro, Beck's been in Vogue. Our boys made it. Yeah. By Drake's definition, they are models. Yeah. No, no, but has Beck and made it? Yeah, Beck yes. was on Beck Vogue was, like, last week. And, and, Beck and, is, a, yeah. is a model. I didn't know he was in Vogue. That's sick. He mm -hmm. signed in everything. That's so Shout sick. Shout out to Dabrowski brothers while we're at it. Hey, we yeah. next up, though. We next up. Yeah. We're going to be on Everyone Vogue you soon. see in this video. Next up, we're it's gonna, gonna be we're modeling. gonna be up next year. Yeah. Except Will, he might be a bit. 
<laughs> that's stupid. Man, get out of here. <laughs> I, I led the way. <laughs> you passed the, the torch. Mm-hmm. So yeah, outlet's fire. <laughs> the Esco one, that was a great one. That was a great one to be at. Yeah, that was really fun. I really if I had to rate one. all of them energy-wise, it would be Esco, North Carolina, Austin, and then the Phoenix one. I feel like the Phoenix energy was better than Austin. The Phoenix energy was cool. Like I wasn't at Colin, Austin. Colin yeah. and Dieter lit, lit it up, really. Mm-hmm. Colin, it, honestly, Krams did some shit, too. That was yeah. pretty good. Yeah. His Colin fucking, his, his alley-oop on the channel gap was so sure. fire. So fire. A- A- Addison sure. took it with his inward whip. Yeah. But I feel like if he didn't do the inward whip, Cramps could have taken it with the alley-oop. Because the alley-oop just looked so good. Mm. Like, I feel like the alley-oop was better than the, visually, yeah. better than the bar-bar-bar that Addison did. But yeah. Addison also did the inward whip. Yeah, which that is, was which crazy. Is, which, and he ate that pole. Yeah, he did Most, twice. Yeah, everyone was scared twice. to jump the channel, bro. Like, I was dying That boy to was that. jumping on that pole. I need some fun. <laughs> yeah, definitely does. Pole, yeah. Yeah. pole jumping. Yeah, pole jumping. <laughs> <laughs> you guys will know what that means soon at some point. Yeah. So what what's next, Will? Yeah, what's next for Undialed? What's next for Outlet? What's next for you? Um so it's actually funny. I feel like this whole year I've been just kind of putting all of my potential energy into Outlet, into planning like just what that how it's all going to go. And I literally haven't thought about what's going to happen next. So we're at uh we're at day 2 <laughs> of recovery from this crazy weekend but also this crazy just, year yeah this crazy year this year has been crazy um it'll, there's a christmas drop but aside from that definitely outlet season two coming up in 2023 Uh-oh. Damn, um, already back to work then plan so getting initiate the planning on that and uh there's gonna be definitely a few tweaks from just what we've learned this year. Of course, this and, was your first year, and and how how it all fell together, um, and and how we're just gonna make it better for the years in the future. I think um, the next year is going to be even better than this year, no doubt. But I think that like now that outlet is kind of an established name and people really understand it. I don't have to re-explain the concept behind it. Every single time I talk about it, people right. kind of just get it. I feel like it's going to be easier to, to have people come out and like convince people to participate in it because they, they've seen what it is. They mm-hmm. understand it. And I think that they really enjoy just the energy and the atmosphere already. And, and in, most of the time people even know somebody that's been to the event. So Coming into next year, I think it'd be really cool to just coordinate dates and plan out things with the collective community and really figure out how we can collectively um, plan out like a calendar where we're not interfering with each other and, and actually make the dates of all of the events and all of the contests and all the ride days all line up. Because one of the main objectives through the outlet year one was to have the banquets and just talk about big things within scootering. And one of the main pieces of constructive criticism I've gotten towards just scootering in general is there needs to be a consistent place where there's a calendar. So it's like planning out the calendar um, with the people who plan the events in scootering. So that way next year, as many scooter riders can go out to as many events as possible instead of just buying their tickets a week before and, and hearing about events really late. I think that Getting everything planned out early would be awesome, yeah. as well as um, now that Outlet has a name, just uh, really, really just growing that name, and and that's that's the goal right now. So Call have you th- have you thought about <laughs> go and grow? Have you thought about international? Definitely, I think like that. The UK, for example. Fuck yeah! I think that the first <laughs> one, the first one would definitely be in the UK. Um, <laughs> whether Shut whether up. that's whether that's Adrenaline Alley or that's Ooh. another skate no. park. Mm. <laughs> um, you, guys, you guys aren't feeling the drill in that, Leon. And and but I feel like yeah, when it does go international, it'll it'll either be Adrenaline Alley or not Adrenaline. It'll either be the UK or to be like the Netherlands, somewhere in just Western nice. Europe, though. Yeah. Some random place. That'd be yeah. fun. Turn up. I That'd feel like it. It would just need to. I feel like there's quite a few things that just need to get 100 percent established in the United States first. Or where we have just kind of our home court advantage, where we have the most connections and we have the most resources yeah. um, at our disposal. Yeah, get it's get not all free. get all yeah. the kinks worked out in the United States, so that way when we Thank bring you. it overseas, it's, it's like it's like a really 
uh, developed structure that we can implement. Well, if you fly out to the UK, me and Jay live together. We've got a spare room, so we can suggest great hotels for you. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Hey. Yeah. First dig. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh you're God. so funny. <laughs> you know who is right. it? Right. Hey, Will, we've got a question for you. Who's funnier, men yeah. or women? And this is online. This is real life. This is live. We want to know. Real the people want to know. They need to Are you to saying know. just like in general or at the extremes? <sighs> in general, general, who's funny on a day-to-day -day basis, bro, men or women? We need you to keep this shit real. Keep eight, it red. Eight, eight more than 92 with us. Easy. Men are more funny. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Like, here's the it's thing. Facts, when bro. I'm with my boys, I'm not going to pretend to laugh. But when I'm with a girl, you know, you sometimes you have to. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Canceled. <laughs> <laughs> he set you up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Women are so funny. <laughs> I know. Eric's been asking. We, we come, where did it even come from? You just asked us in the car. I don't even remember. We're Eric's driving down Eric's. the road and we pull up. With Daniel's driving. Eric is in the passenger seat riding shotgun. And we pull up to this car next to us. And they've got the windows down and he asked them like, oh, who's funnier, men or women? And this, this guy is like, oh, men for sure. And he's like, yeah, okay, cool. Next set of lights, pull up again. There's like a man and a woman in the car. And, and Eric goes, hey, yo, who's funnier, men or women? And she, the woman answers and she goes, women. And we all laughed. <laughs> and she goes, see? <laughs> <laughs> and she we're won like, ah, she shut it down we lost yeah, that was we smart lost. and that was the first that woman was... we actually asked so <laughs> yeah, we were like looking yeah. bad we were like yeah. oh man and then the other <laughs> the, there wrong. was another couple wasn't there where you said who's funny on men and women and she goes women and the guy goes fuck off <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's been good. the thing of our entire conversations like no, last week <laughs> last week do we talk you see how we're having a podcast right now We've had 15 of these, and they're all five hours long. When we're supposed to be leaving? Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Where was the place that we were in? Uh, Chiba Hut? No. Uh, um, no, and we were sat we there were, for ages, and a, the Dave, second Dave, we left, they locked Dave's, the door behind Dave, us. Oh, that was Chiba Hut. No, that was Chiba Hut. Dave's. Oh, okay. that was Chiba when they, Hut. When they were waiting for us yeah, to leave, yeah, yeah, to lock the door. This one wasn't Dave's. Yeah, we had a ton, a, a ton of places. Yeah. And this is how we met. Like, when we all met, we all met in Barcelona. And we were at Marbella, yeah. And the lights were off, and we were all still there, there for like another three hours before we moved, to, two hours maybe before we moved to like ten feet, ten feet, and started doing the same thing. We'd where stop we just like talked. every twenty minutes or half an hour and be like, "All right, let's go," and we'd all shuffle maybe like five steps. No, I know, I know the movement. Yeah, come on now, it's crazy. <laughs> that was that was good. That was good. Yeah, but our conversations have been so progressive lately. It's great. It's great. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. <laughs> We might run for like. <laughs> yeah. We've been breaking barriers, knocking Shh. walls down. Yeah. Getting getting the to the fucking wall? point. All right. What's the most recent wall? No, we can't. We can't do that on, on air. Most we recent can't. wall. <laughs> we can't talk yeah. about that on air. <laughs> what is the most recent wall we've broken? Uh, I think our last conversation was. <laughs> Cat calling men on the street. Cat, uh, calling, uh, cat calling men on the street. That was a slight little, you know, turn. That was just a detour. Yeah, that was a detour. Yeah. That was a tweet. That was a tweet. But but I, was, episode. Just that was a tweet, not a whole you, Facebook post. How do yeah. men feel about being catcalled? When they get catcalled. And not by a woman. When it's a dude <laughs> in the car and he's telling you, hey, Zaddy. And you're like, they, you look good. They, 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 yeah, you did look it to really the three, good. and all three felt very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. So I'm like, <sighs> we're doing studies here. That's what men, yeah. It is. Eyes have yeah, been yeah. opened. They're learning. Yeah. Don't it is an eye-opening experience. Yeah. What if the, what if it was like what if the dude was fine though? Well, then none of them were. Then I mean, that depends if he feels uncomfortable. Then that's just the like you know it's just one out of f four, and that's his business. <laughs> it's one out of four, you know. So I mean, I know if someone cat called me, I'd. Yeah, we'd be hyped. I'm, I'm playing back. I'd be like, hey, hey thank you, bro. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. asking me for my Instagram. I'm going over. I'm yeah, thanks. <laughs> I know what I gay shit. <laughs> 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 then see if he feels comfortable or not. Flip the because. switch. Yeah, facts. But yeah. the thing is, is not everyone's built like us. No, nope. no, no, no. We're cut from a different cloth. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. What cloth is that? 
We call so yeah. real. I'm, I mean, I'm we, 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 we just we just we just okay, yeah. we yeah, just yeah, exist. Yeah, we're excited. We just existing, you know. I was gonna say like suede, you know. I like suede. Hey. Suede, yeah, some ca- silk, some cashmere, some silk. Stuff yeah, yeah, silk is nice. Nice, nice little smooth. We smooth. Like, exactly. Everyone's usually cotton, you know. I'm cashmere. Lace. Cashmere. I'm lacy. We're all the funniest Let's guys we know. <laughs> at all times. Mm-hmm. That's funny. Yeah, leave it in the see? comments below if you've laughed at least once during this video. Yeah, and comment who it was from. If if you didn't laugh, then I guess we're just full of ourselves. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Or you're not funny. Yeah. Yeah. Or you're or a woman. Your, or it's your problem. <laughs> yeah. or he said, or Eric said, or you're a woman. <laughs> what? This one isn't getting monetized. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're getting, you're this getting reported for sure. Yeah. yeah, this is now fresh and fit. This is pay per view now. <laughs> hey, so, so what's on the what's on the forecast for Friday? Friday, 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 What's up? At hey, every yo. single one of these like Events. points, yeah. these like little like stops in our in our packed weekend. What 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 what? <laughs> He's my had boy a does sweet God's tooth. Work. Oh my god! At outlet, there we go. Shout out to Devil's Liquor. <laughs> there we go. Because oh homeboy never told me his name. Niall. Niall. Because when I met him in San Diego, he's like, bro, just call me Devil's Liquor. Okay, so Niall, um, he had some homies there. Yeah, he had Seth. Nah. 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 He had Chanel. some ho- he had some home girls there. Mm. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it was so funny. Eric, Eric came up to me and he was like, bro, 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 bro. I just saw a black girl here. <laughs> and I was like, no way. <laughs> And I was like, you want me to go find her? So and tell her that you're looking for her. <laughs> He's like, no, 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 no. And I was like, all right, I'm going to go. I'm going to go look for her. <laughs> I didn't have to look far because we just went to Heartbreak Harbor's um, booth. booth. Shout out Heartbreak Harbor. If you don't follow them, follow them now. And RJ. And, <laughs> and RJ. And RJ. RJ, Tito, and Gabe. So we went to the Heartbreak Harbor booth. And uh, they just pulled up to the Heartbreak Harbor booth. And we're looking at all the, the very... Um, Fine garments. Quality garments that Heartbreak Harbor collects, you know? And um, I told Eric, I was like, bro, 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 there she is, there she is. So my boy Eric, you know, he's got to take a swing. Always has to. <laughs> hey, what was that, the line you, you guys said? You miss, you miss 100% of the shots that you don't take. Just saying. Yeah. yeah so absolutely. he took that shot. Facts. And he didn't miss. He didn't miss. He got Vicks and Chanel's Instagrams. Mm. Damn. Look at that. At the scooter event, only at Outlet, guys. Listen to that. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so I just like <laughs> you were yeah. saying. You were saying this Outlet oh, the energy was dead. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> hey, all no, right, we're, we're we're making new shit happen at Outlet. All right. <laughs> oh man. Hey, but Devil, shout out to Devil's Liquor for bringing that energy because we, <laughs> <laughs> we needed that energy. Hey, shout out Niall. Shout out Niall. Yeah, so there you go. But this <laughs> this time he made he made the three pointer at that. At hey. that you, know? Yeah. you know, he, and then we went roller skating. Yeah, and then we went roller skating, which was he took an L at Cramps' letter. I want, at, at I, want, I want the boys to talk about it because I've I took them to my like rink, the rink that I would go to to roller skate, which I've already been to a ton of times. I've been Great there before, skate. but this is their first time going to a roller rink mm-hmm. in America. Yeah, tell us what it's like. Yeah. Well, I mean, me and Jay have been to one before. In the one, been to one roller skate oh. rink before, and it was yeah. literally like an eighth of the size of that one. Like the actual rink yeah. was like, it was like a square. Yeah, <laughs> literally. Like a tiny square. Yeah, like probably four of these rooms. That's it. Wow. Yeah. But that one banged. Like the music was popping, yeah. the people were popping, everyone was just jumping. like dancing, like car sick, pump pump jumping. Was sick. Everyone was good, and let me tell you now, this boy sitting across from us. He's, he's been got the ta- drip. No, he's been talking about how smooth Eric is the whole time. He hasn't mentioned himself. You know why? Because he's humble. 
Yeah. <laughs> he is fucking sexy. No, he's when fucking he not. He's not humble at all. <laughs> you know who you're talking to? <laughs> oh, <no>. This <laughs> is the cockiest motherfucker I know. All right. He literally he's calls himself the enough. Drake of Scooter Rage. <laughs> that's, that's an understatement because he's better than that. When he hops on, on yeah, and off yeah, the skates, yeah. but when he's on the skates, my God, he is smooth. I almost took him home. Well, I did take him. He took me home. <laughs> he is smooth with it and it, it actually pisses me off because... I need to be that good, and I'm not. I did do a couple of full cabs though. He did, sick, yeah. Sick, no. I was dope. popping some three sixty. Maddie's was feeling. Maddie was feeling. Yeah. All right. She was like, yeah. Shout but, out Maddie. But Daniel, Daniel, smooth with them. Honestly, he was he was an inspiration. That's all I can say. No, he's a beast on the blades. Mm -hmm. Or not, not blades, blades <laughs> on the rollies. Quads. I think he's a little washed though now. He is a little bit washed. Yeah. He did fall bit. over. I fell a lot. Yeah. I haven't Brandon been in a long time. Well, I haven't been in a long time, Brandon's so I was a little sick washed. I love Brandon. Shout out Brandon. Love Shout him. out Bows. Yeah, bro. Shout he has also been a great factor throughout their trip. Has he trip. stopped? Oh, my God. Has he stopped roller skating? No, 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 no. He's only been progressing. Yeah, but... Uh, <laughs> shout out Ricky. Yeah, shout out Ricky. He was at the rink and making us laugh like crazy. But Brandon has popping in and out of these boys' trip. He's been, like, meeting up with the... They just met Brandon on this trip. Mm -hmm. And they were able to kick it with him, talk with him. Brandon has just always been a great person, always making kiss. us laugh. If I mean, I said to you before, I want to take him home. <laughs> yeah. I want, him, every, I want the, to take him home with me. For the amazing. viewers wondering who Brandon is, you will, mo you will know him more. Or He's more known as either Bose or only Raw. <laughs> <laughs> you will catch him on Instagram oh, by no, those no. two handles. And he actually hates that we call him Brandon. He really? needs us to call him Bose. <laughs> Bose. He's like, quit fucking calling me Brandon. It's Bose. And Bose. he's black. <laughs> he's he's Afro-Latino. No, he's not. He's Afro-Latino. He showed me a picture of his parents today. It was real of convincing. What? Of his Should, parents. Oh, his parents. Yeah, his oh, grandparents damn. and his oh, parents. Oh, something else? And, oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it was convincing. That's why they call but Brandon, Bose. Brandon <laughs> went to the rink with us, and Brandon is also very smooth. Yeah. The boys met all the homies. They met all my local homies, and mm -hmm. it's just been... A quality time. Very packed. Is Chris there? No. Probes? Crunk? No. Uh, no, they Sam. haven't met him. Don't say wish. all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Facts. But it was fun. It was so much fun. Oh. Yeah. Never mind. No, no, Eric made another three. Oh. <laughs> We were leaving. We were leaving the rink, and he was talking to one of the homies. Bro, you should have seen this man. He was leaning no on one. another man's car. <laughs> no one was in the car. He was literally just posted. He was up. posted up like this, like yeah, you know, I'm from New York, man. You know, it's oh, Bronx, you know, it's Bronx, God. it's Bronx. You know? <laughs> <laughs> and and she was like, like hey, oh, you, for you got Instagram. Instagram. You got Instagram. You got Instagram. Follow me. Look at him. <laughs> Doesn't know what to say. Cheesing, cheesing <laughs> me, bro. He was cheesing her all yeah, night. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> It was so much fun. Do you know what's so funny is Eric once told me, he's a very wise man, <laughs> Eric, and um, he once told me from the start of time. I'm never watching the, this podcast the, when it comes out. In the past, <laughs> in the present, and until the end of time, women will be the downfall of men. Fact. He said that. Hey, a strong man's biggest vulnerability. You see that, right? Is, her, mm -hmm. is his it's woman. Yeah, that's yeah, right. yeah, women. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wedding in pink. <laughs> so, so, no, so that all means. and you you listen to this conversation and who's the ladies man? Uh, it's Eric. Derek. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he scored a lot of shots this weekend. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What you cooking up for tonight? This podcast. Hey. <laughs> now after this, we're gonna go hang out with Brandon. Yeah, yeah, we might run into another little thing. Uh, hey, sauce. Devil's Liquors across hey, the street. Hey, hey. <laughs> 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 who knows? Who knows? One one girl might get lucky tonight. <laughs> or I'm two. excited. I'm excited to see Brandon again. This is mine and Jay's last night in America. Now we're flying out oh, tomorrow. Yeah. Are you guys going back to the UK? We gotta finish yeah. our verse. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Damn it. It's true. Hey, when do you go home? I go home Saturday, so I'm still here. I'm oh, still fuck yeah. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, we still got a lot to do. Yeah, you guys Stay got tuned for that on the vlog at Eric Too Real. You can go check that out. See, we'll be Check that out on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram. Yeah. Well, you know well hey, boys, I appreciate you guys coming on this podcast right now. Of I course. think that uh, this was a nice time, time stamp in life. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys. Should we do another outro song? Yeah, hit us with the outro song. <laughs> 
Uh, <laughs> hey, give, me, give me a word, Will. Just give me a word. Um, Bomba clat. Bomba clat. Yeah. Bomba clat. Bomba clat. You know. Okay. Yeah. Thursday to Thursday. Cindy cannot Thursday hear what's going Thursday. on right now. Thursday to Thursday. Thursday. <laughs> Thursday to Thursday. 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 Thursday to Thursday. Thursday. Thursday to Thursday. Thursday. Thursday.